Hello everyone, welcome to day 8 of the 30 faces in 30 days challenge. Today I wanted to use my Bristol paper that came in the Art Sanks box because I didn't get to use it for my challenge back then because the supplies didn't really work with that and because usually Bristol paper is great with ink I also wanted to use my Copic drawing pen and it's like a fountain pen. This one has sepia ink, it also comes in black the Copic drawing pens are fountain pens, but they're throwable ones. So once you run out of ink, you just run out of ink, which is really a shame if you ask me because it's a real waste. But I wanted to try it. And so that's what I did uh, for today's portrait. I only used this pen on the paper and I did mostly cross hatching. So I must say I really like the color of the ink, but the pen feels a little dry. It flows well, but it feels a little dry. Now I haven't done um, since Inktober any cross hatching and I was not that great at it back then already. And if there was one thing I would change with this portrait, it would be to start with the hair because there were so many lines that I had to draw for the hair. It actually was a warm up. So once I was done with the hair, I was more comfortable with the pen. I kind of uh, knew how it worked a little bit better. And then I could have done a better job on the face. Because I think I went a little overboard on the profile side, on the right side. Even though that side of the face was all shadows, I still think I went a bit too dark. And the lines aren't very good either. The quality is uh, not so great. But I'm pretty pleased with the hair. Now, I'm not sure what happened. The pen was working fine for a while and then it seemed like it was drying out. I'm sure there's still some ink in it because I've never used it for anything else. And uh, I think maybe that it's the, the paper that it doesn't like. Because every so often I had to wipe the tip and there was a little bit of a paper residue. So, not quite sure. I'll have to try it on a paper that's maybe not as smooth as this one. I... I don't know, but I'm kind of disappointed because it worked very well at the beginning and uh, and the ink flowed pretty nicely too and then towards the end it was drier and drier. Regardless, um, I think I need to practice more working with lines and hatches and cross hatches. So I might do a few more before the end of the challenge just to practice. I do enjoy just drawing those lines. It feels pretty soothing to me. I just need to control myself and not go overboard in uh, too many places. So anyway, that's it for today. Thank you all for stopping by. I'll see you tomorrow with day 9 of the challenge. If you like this video, please give it a like. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. Have a wonderful day everyone. Bye bye. Thank you.